So we are currently planning an event and this is a project in Asana. And what we want to do is to add resources that we have saved in Microsoft SharePoint or um, OneDrive. And you see that every project in Asana comes with key resources. Yeah, I can create a um, project brief and explain to everyone uh, where to find everything. But the most important thing is that all the documents that are saved within um, SharePoint are added here. So I can open them and then automatically it brings me to the document or to the folder in SharePoint. And the easy thing to do is just to click here, say SharePoint, and then SharePoint opens here, and then you can just uh, open whatever document and folder you have. You click Save, and when once done, document is here. So on each project level, all the documents and folders that are relevant for the project are there. The same works for Teams and Tasks, so let's look at this now. So on a specific task that I'm now assigning to me to attach the attendance and registration targets, I just click here on the three dots, and um, sorry, on the uh, attachment sign here and say OneDrive SharePoint. Again, the same overview opens so I can add um, here folder. I can add the document, click choose. And in a bit, the document is uploaded here. Boom, it is in the task. And everyone who's now part of the task has the document and clicks on it and will be forwarded right to SharePoint. That's how you add SharePoint tasks and folders to a task. You can also always go and copy the URL and put it here. So that's also very easy to do. And the next thing is to look at a team. So in Asana, every team that you have that organizes all the tasks and um, uh, projects that you have, you have a description here on the right side and you can tell people, hey, here are all the documents and the links to SharePoint and you can just click and then people can uh, will be directly forwarded to the pages in SharePoint and everything that is needed to connect the team. So you have it on the team uh, list, you have it on the project list, and you have it on the task list as we saw before.